Has anybody seen that chemical imbalance? No, they only say they've seen it in uh, uh, in brain scans. Now, brain scans show the activity of the brain, not of the person. So you make a distinction between the activity of the brain and the activity of the person. I sure do. How come we are not looking to brain scan to explain why one person is a good musician and is a great musician and the other one doesn't know how to play the piano? They have been looking at that. They have, that, they, they have been looking at, and what the, do they find? at the differential development of brains of great yeah, musicians. No, 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 but can they make a diagnosis of, a, of an orchestra leader as compared to somebody who doesn't know anything about music from a brain scan? Nobody even thinks of that. Can they make a distinction between an Einstein and somebody who's illiterate? from a brain scan. No. They don't even research that. The prejudice here is to show that what we call mental illness, which is human behavior, is an illness. Well, if that's your prejudice, for you be my guest. I'm going to have to say, you are a psychiatrist. You are an MD. When you had your practice, did you see pe people who came to you